Well, it runs ham. Calling of Counter Strike Go, take three. All right. Fuck. After like 50,000 hours of dealing with bullshit and my computer freezing, deleting shit, not existing, and uh, videos just not working out generally, we're here to bring you some pro tips on Counter Strike. Um, Tinderbox, this is my pal. Oliver right back, good night mates. And uh, yeah, so we're just gonna give you a few tips on how to play Counter Strike and how to really succeed at doing well in this game. Here we are, Counter Strike. Now, my partner Tinderbox over here knows a bit more about it than I do, but I'm gonna help you him out as much as I possibly can. All right, we're gonna join Counter Terrorists because uh, we're not total assholes. And uh, let's start off, start off teaching a little bit about pistols. Pistol away. Okay, I've chosen to buy the most advanced and perfect pistol there is, the uh, USPS. Okay, so first technique, which I didn't, you fucking retard, oh, comments, my favorite. Now remember, apparently in this game, what you really want to do is you really, really want to talk as much shit as possible. Hey buddy, fuck your mom last night. See, he knows. Now he's gonna go cry. Oh, chickens! Okay, we'll deal with the chickens after I'm done dealing with this dude's dead body. Uh, look at that, see? Easy peasy, lemon breezy. Jesus Christ, that dude sniped me with a fucking AK. He's probably hacking. That's another thing. Everyone who kills you is a hacker. And there could also be lag involved, and I like to blame it on a little bit of both. Because awesome. it usually is. That and the fact that you're just not trash talking quite enough. Yeah, you gotta talk shit about them, you gotta tell them what you did with their mother last night, and uh, describe their family as a whole. Come on, dude, fucking spawn. It's always good to take the fucking quickest route possible to kill them. So if you see them sitting there, they think they're all invincible and shit, you hold the gun right up to their head and teach them not to do that. Weapons accurate range is the distance at which your penis is. Whoa, dinner plate? Dude, I'm hungry. <laughs> we just ate. Oh, right, not here. enough. Back into dust. Okay. Two. Go. The sequel. Uh, we'll play Scout Terrace again, because hell yeah. Alright, so as we've been going to show you before, uh, shotgun. Now, people want you to think that you need not a load of shotguns, so that way you don't waste time pumping. But remember, the pump action is what makes it great. That sound will strike fear into the enemy's hearts, just like you need it to. Also, a lot of people will tell you that shotguns are short-range weapons, and that's just a load of bullshit. Ah, now see, last recording, we couldn't get it done right, because the chickens came out and attacked us. Yes, these fucking chickens, in case you all don't know, are pure evil. There we go. Good lord. See, and the hackers too. There we go. Gotta kill those goddamn hacking chickens. Now see, that guy was using the, uh... He was using the wrong... Oh, actually, that's a girl, a girl named Kermit. Uh, female gamer. You, you gotta... Now remember, Watch she's a that. female gamer. One thing you don't want to do is talk to her at all. Okay. Shoot your teammate as much as possible. It That'll gives them an extra health and extra armor from any damage they might receive. Also, it just keeps them alert, you know? If you're, if you're getting shot at, you're going to be more alert. than. Uh, see, look, I just dropped that dude. Sort of. Not really, but we can pretend, right? Yep. Part of the fun of this game is having an imagination. And killing the chickens, those all dirty bastards. Fucking over here. Jesus Christ. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, these guys want to play. Alright. I'm going to switch to a shorter range weapon because they're not three miles away. <laughs> okay, see, you gotta... See, now he got killed by somebody. And you know what you want to say? Hacker. Okay, I guess uh, that kill that I just got puts us into the next round. Uh, the next, next round of pro tips that I was going to give. When you're using an SMG, or uh, any really full auto heavy machine weapon, you never want to lay off the trigger. You want to just put as many bullets down range as possible. Remember, the more that are there, the better chance you have of hitting any target you want. See, now that guy was hacking, and there was so much lag right there. I'm probably getting like one frame per second, but that's cool. Oh, look at this dude. This dude doesn't even know what's about to happen to him. Get fucked. Get Always take right. the cheap as hell kills because, I mean, they do it to you, so you gotta do it back to them. Okay, now I'm gonna teach this dude a little bit about my. Oh, see, there's this fucking chicken again. Aha! Uh -huh. See, we've had trouble with this chicken in particular. Always up to something, scheming. Here, let me use my explosive knife. Bam! 
Remember, the more pro you are, the pro your knife looks. It's gonna have scopes, attachments, another knife underneath your knife. Dual, dual blade knife. Wow, these guys can't even handle my full auto spray right now. The full auto spray and pray method works. You don't ever I'm aim. Using my tactics correctly. See, if you don't, if you don't use the tactics, there's no way you're gonna fucking win. Like these guys are using sniper rifles, long range. What the fuck is that shit? Spam with the knife. Spam with it. Hmm. That guy. Uh, he must have been wearing. No, that was Kevin. That was a guy. Oh, okay, cool. Notice the spray technique is actually working really effective against these guys because they are what we call noobs. Uh, such as uh, XXX underscore noob noob 420 underscore XXX. Now remember, the more X's you have in your name, the more badass you seem. The more you frighten your enemies. Holy shit, that actually worked. Look at this dude. Look at this dude coming at me like he thinks I'm on his team or something. Teach him a fucking lesson. Look at me twice, asshole. Yeah, damn straight I attacked the teammate. He was being a fuck up about it. That's cool. Who's blood? Ah, oh, see, I'm just being a janitor here. Just clean it off. Yo, a clean workplace is a friendly workplace. And we're all about making friends. There we go. Nice and clean. And we can clean out this wall too. No, okay. That guy was talking so much shit on me that... I mean, he was obviously a good player because he was talking shit, but... We're gonna need to teach him a lesson or two. All right, now we're moving into the new category, sniper rifles. Now, what you want to do is you want to take the slowest rate of fire one as possible. Yeah, bolt action is preferred. Uh, the least shots you can fire, the more more damage they'll do, and uh, the more wrecking you'll do. And remember, never use the scope. Scope is for pussies and rookies, and we're neither of those, as and, far as I'm aware. And noobs. All right, look, this chicken wants a little bit. Remember, the chickens are always working with the terrorists. Good lord, see? see? The chicken distracted me. Jesus fuck, 292 in one hit. God must have been dropping tactical nukes on my dick. Yeah. Now my teammate, I'm gonna use him, I'm gonna use the bait tactic. I let him get killed, I watch him die, I teabag him a little, get his power, and then uh, go finish the job. Ah, oh, see, I didn't I didn't teabag enough, I didn't get enough of his power. You know what, it might actually come down to it, Tinder. I think we're gonna have to bust out the semi-auto. Oh god, that'll be nasty. This guy uh, is using. Well, nah, he was he was a fuckboy, so we had to teach him a lesson. Hello. All right, it's that time. Now you don't want to do this very often, but sometimes you just require it. Ooh. Break out the fifty, the sixty-four round magazine. Fucking hey, that dude was. Oh, clearly hacking. Come on, look at that. Obviously a hack. Now remember, anytime somebody kills you, they're hacking. Sweet. And uh, it's great when it lets you run out of time, because then that means that you were just relaxing. Nice day at the spa. Now my teammate here seems to be in trouble, so let's help him out a little. Pull the trigger and never stop firing. See? Tactic works. Remember, always keep a full magazine, so that way your spray and pray gets that much better. And you may notice that I just unleash on uh, a couple teammates that I see. That's because you never want to take the risk. Yeah, you never want to accidentally not fire. See, that man was clearly acting because he did two shots with a bolt action in two seconds. That's impossible. 204 in four hits. Dude hit me in four hits faster than freaking Muhammad Ali could punch anything. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, boy. Remember, don't stop firing until the magazine is empty. Yeah, Even if he's dead, just keep firing to make sure you never know what these hackers. Same thing goes with zombie apocalypse, because you never know. Ah, well, I, I got the assist, so that's that's always good. Remember, your teammates are out to get you just as much as they're out to get the enemy. They want to steal your kills, and you, you don't want that to happen. I'm using the unleash uh, pistol technique on that guy. Uh, very effective, especially at long to medium range. Close range, you probably want to avoid something it. like a uh, sniper rifle, something a little more close range. Uh, now, see, my guy took a couple couple eternities to reload there, but that's because he's not trained in the art of reloading. Now, another thing we want to talk about is the Zeus. How you want to use this technique is you want to charge and get as close as possible to your enemy. Well, I just wasted my round, but that was because uh, I was showing the viewers how to use it. Now we're going to use the uh, shotgun technique. Oh, see, he got me from behind. Fucker. All right, now I'll effectively show use of the Zeus. Yeah, baby. Uh, A.K.A. the Bidoof Cannon, because of how fucking overpowered it is. It is OP to the max. 
Okay, now see, this door's, this door's causing me a little trouble here. The door's on the fucking terrorist side. We need to teach, teach you a thing or two. Holy fucking shit. I didn't have time to pull out my Zeus, and that's why I lost. See, had I effectively used the Zeus. What like if I use grenades on this round? Teach, teach a little bit. Okay, see, you got a bobbin weave. You got a bobbin weave. They'll bobbin never weave. See They'll never fucking see your shit coming. Fuck. I missed, but that's just because I, uh... I mean, he was hacking. There was no way around that. Obviously. Obviously. Yeah. Some fucking... mm. Not allowed. Bull fucking shit. Now, apparently we're not going to be able to demonstrate this tactic. But what you want to do is, if you get into a round where you can use grenades, be sure to pick up incendiary types. Molotovs and incendiary grenades. And what you want to do is, you want to hit your team with them. Because you want them to be sure that they're nice and toasty. Hypothermia is the real enemy of this game. Along with the chickens. Fucking chickens. Hey, uh, Mr. Chicken there, you want to become my new fucking five-piece meal? Get over here. Jesus Christ. Turn radius of zero. Hey, I got one point for that. New plan. Kill all the chickens, get points. <laughs> Kill chickens, get money. Literally. See? See? It points out clearly one point for neutralizing an enemy with a deagle. That's because the chickens are the enemy, as we've been trying to tell you. Chickens are the real enemy here. The terrorists aren't doing anything. They're just fucking rolling around these streets trying to kill the chickens like us. We don't see. Whoa, shit, son. Fucking hacking bullshit. Remember, if anything happens, you gotta call hacks. Otherwise, you ki your kill doesn't count. There's my glitchy-ass mouse here. Uh, we'll be counter-terrorists again. We'll awesome. teach you a little bit more about terrorists next time. How they do. Because that's when we're gonna have the bomb. Zeus, eh? We'll whoop this guy out again. We didn't effectively show his use, so time to, you know, bob and weave, show him what you did in football. Damn. Oh, hey, hey, hey Ollie. What's up? You see these cars over here? Oh, I do indeed, Mike. Oh, oh, do I not see what I think I should see? Oh, I don't do see any know? fucking seatbelts in these cars. Exactly. That's why they're so dangerous to be around. Yeah, those fucking cars are on fire. They'd be fine if there was seatbelts in them. No one could have done. We could have saved so many lives. Goddamn seatbelts. Yeah. See, that's why these cars are shit. No seatbelts. Ah, oh, the spray and pray tactic, as usual, done. Well, look at that hacker. <laughs> Fucking hacker. Okay. We're gonna use a little, uh, a little Hamas action. Yeah, teach them how to. See, look at that. Spray and pray and got a dome rocket. Did you steal my kill, you little fucking asshole? What? Guess what? Your mom is a nice person. Damn whoa, straight. whoa. Bust that. The real moves there, buddy. Mm. Might want to calm it down. Oh, chicken. Chicken all over loose. Kill it. Hey, Mr. Chicken. How you doing? Bok, bok, bok. Bok, bok, motherfucker. Damn straight. Lay these eggs, son. Oh, you were hiding back here? See? Another chicken and Jesus goat. Christ, Jesus Christ. Fucking... Chickens and goats with the enemy. Bulletproof chickens up in this bitch. Oh, this guy wants to fuck with me. Damn, what the fuck was he using? Hacks. <coughs> okay, a little bit more. We'll show you a little bit more uh, with the rifle here. With the bolt action. Obviously, you want to be as close as possible with the sniper rifle. Remember, they're close range weapons. Oh, oh. there's a lag. Somebody's hacking again. Goddamn hackers. Tell me this fucking video is going to record. Because if it doesn't, I might shit a brick, literally. Oh, good lord, with this lag. Oh, lagging out. Fucking eh? Those hacks must be putting a lot of strain on those servers. Ah, now this shotgun. <coughs> Whoa, see? Tires are also in cahoots with the enemy. You know why? Because none of the cars have seat belts. Always pre-fire around corners. Just unload your fucking mag. Here we go. This dude wants a little bit. He wants to taste. He, he wants, wants to, to taste, taste the velvety goodness. Taste some fucking goodness. Taste my velvet. Yeah, damn straight. Oh, look at all these fucking chickens. Kill the chickens! See, this is why you need grenades. You gotta kill as many chickens as possible. Good lord. Everywhere, chickens. Oh, see, right behind you. The chickens were the distractions, so that way you could get killed by the terrorists. I'm gonna go try and find those chickens again, teach them a lesson. Teach them a fucking lesson in business. Never fuck with my dual barretas. That's how you pronounce it, by the way. Oh, right, you know. I think, uh. Oh, wow. That actually, uh. We're gonna have to go take a look at that real quick again. Where the fuck are you? You're down here. Oh, shit. Here we go. Oh. 
Yeah, oh. Minus all the dead bodies, that, that little canyon down there might make a nice summer home. Indeed. The only problem is you gotta clear out the terrace and the chickens. That's true. I mean... Where the fuck am I? Oh, that's where I am. Okay, cool. Always forget exactly where you are in the map. That makes it... Remember, only noobs memorize maps. And look at the lag. See? 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 Look at that. Did you guys not see that lag in getting him killed? I got killed by a fucking boot. There we go. Nam, son. Alright, see, this is a more accurate description of what a Counter-Strike game should look like. You should generally go, like, 0 and 53, but... I guess if you're having a shitty day, you go, like, I don't know, 5 and 16 or something. That's just uncalled for. Average game, though, is about 1 and 28. I'd say. A little bit, a little bit higher. The death ratio. Quick! To the summer home! Oh! I see chickens. we've got a visitor. Taken down. I'm gonna win on fucking chicken points alone. Now, what you wanna do now is you wanna find a spot. And you wanna camp the shit out of it. Alright, can I build a fire? Let's see. Is these as sparks? See, I claimed it with my smiley face. Actually, you know what we need? We need... We need some, uh, velvety goodness. That's a piece of cake, man. <laughs> of course. Obviously, you need to have the velvet goodness. Look at that cake. I don't think I've ever seen a more perfect cake. Let's just add that in. A little frosting. A little candle on top. Looks like a stupid, fucked up cat. Okay. Well, either way, there's our, there's our cake. We claimed our territory. Kill the chickens! Good lord. Bam. You're dodging my knife like goddamn Bruce Lee over here. Oh! From behind. Remember, what you always need to do is kill people from behind. Killing them in the face just makes them feel like they've accomplished something. That they saw you coming. See? No honor in that. You want to shoot people in the back. And then shit talk them because they suck and they're noobs. Man, this chicken can take more hits than I can. Holy shit. Get back here, you fucking... You fucking chicken. Jesus Christ, dude. Now remember, your teammates are not out there to help you. They're there to be bullet sponges and be shit-talked as well. Yeah, always use your allies as meat shields whenever possible. This guy, uh... Oh, see? I, you even gotta keep clicking after, because sometimes you'll find an extra bullet. Oh, this is a perfect tick. Okay. No, this is a perfect time to demonstrate the long-distance capabilities of this shotgun. Uh, though I guess my teammate took all my fucking kills. Hey, Mr. Chicken, what you doing? How you doing, baby? Just, uh, bop. Fuck. See, See the chicken. Look at the lag. The chicken's causing lags, so that way he could get killed. Be careful. Chickens are the enemy. Motherfucker. He was in my summer home. I even claimed it. That son of a bitch. Time to go clear. Time to go clean halves. Oh, not you again. Oh, hell no. Not today. Not any day. Motherfucker. See? He's the no scope hacks. tactic. But that was definitely hacks. There's so much hacking going on. Whoa! I mean, the dude's not going to have kids anymore, but... What kind okay. of life is that? And that is the true test of how you kill people. What? Look at that, see? Exactly what we pointed out. Kill stealing. Fucking... I'm going to follow his ass. Use him as a meat shield. Yeah, fucking steal his kill back. Mmm, what you know about me? What you know, what you know about me? Sorry. Don't forget to teabag also. Teabagging boosts your shit. Boosts all of your stats. Now, here we go. Long range attacking with the shotgun. Now, fuck those sniper rifle bastards. This chicken knows what's going on. Oh, that chicken's in the summer home. What the fuck's my cake? There we go. God damn chickens. Oh, fuck, there's another one. Oh, see? The chickens are in cahoots with the terrorists. Here we go. Oh. McDonald's is actually on the side of the CTs. Bob and weave, Bob and weave. Atta boy. Yeah. Save me. Nah, more like stole my kill. What a bitch. Skills. Pro. And uh, after a good after a good match of Counter Strike, you want to go in and uh, send everyone a message telling them how how stupid they are and how much you wrecked them. Remember, chat is used for shit talk. And oh. that's here we go, this is good. A semi-automatic rifle. Yeah, 27 seconds left. Let's do this. Do it! Pull the trigger! See? Look at that. Shot in the back. That's a true tactic right there. Mm -hmm. 
He's a true pro. I, I prefer the spray technique, but when I have to, I'll use the uh, aim down sights. But that's only for <coughs> obscure situations. Good lord. It's like a freaking rabbit went down my throat. <coughs> All right. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that's a little bit of velvet on the town teaching you to be a pro at Counter-Strike. Yeah, hopefully this helps you out and you can move your KD up to something like mine, you know, 6 and 29. Shit's amazing. That's true Counter-Strike right there. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be back next time teaching you how to do bomb defusal and planting. And, uh, let's see. I guess shout out to my sister for making a pretty badass intro. Shit's, uh, shit's on point. And uh, yeah, alright, that's it. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, all that good jazz. And always remember, wear your seatbelt. Fascinating. Fascinating, too. Otherwise, you're gonna fucking explode. Like those cars. People are trying to prove I dance last night. It's not happening. Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> there is no proof I dance. Yeah.